Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to remove the rear bumper on the 2013 and 14 Ford Mustangs. We're going to get started by removing the tail lights and that's done by first taking out this thumb screw. Once you have that out of the way you can peel back this plastic cover and you can see the nut underneath. There are three of these and I believe they are 12 millimeter. Go ahead and take these out. There's one. Yeah, I apologize. I don't know the exact size. They're either 12 millimeters or 13 millimeters. Go ahead and peel back this trunk lining and you can see the rest of the nuts. I'm going to take those out right now. After you have those removed, just go ahead and pull back on the tail light. And before you can take it out all the way, go ahead and disconnect the electrical plug. And there you go. Take that out of the way and do the other side. With the tail lights removed, we can now move on to the various clips and screws that hold the bumper in place. And first thing we're going to do is remove these three screws that are found on the inside of the wheel well. As you can see, I'm just using a regular Phillips head screwdriver bit. With those out of the way, go ahead and move down to the bottom side. You can see there are two push pin clips. Go ahead and use a flathead screwdriver to pry out the center and then take the whole clip out. Obviously, do the same thing on the other side of the car. Okay, and there's a few more clips left. Here's a shot of the other style. Same principle here, just remove the center with the flathead screwdriver and then take the whole clip out. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Great, so once you have those taken out, we have two more clips left. Now these are a little bit trickier. The best thing to use here is a tool designed for taking out the clips because these are real easy to break and they only come out one way. I'm going to show you a shot of them. You can see the two hooks. There it is, and yeah, the tool works really well for these style of clips. We are now ready to take out the bumper. Go ahead and grab the sides and just start giving it a pull. You can feel the clips releasing. This one right here, you want to push in with your fingers to take it out. Do the same thing on the other side of the bumper, and when those are free, give it a nice pull. The best thing to do is grab the bumper with both hands in the center and give it a quick pull. I'll show you a shot of these clips that are in the center. That is what's holding the bumper in place. So don't be afraid to pull on it. Now before you can take out the bumper all the way, you can see this wiring harness that needs to come out. And to do that we gotta take out this plastic cover. Go ahead and remove these two push pins. These are pretty tough to get out without the tool, but you can also use some pliers. Got one. We're going to get one on the other side. Once those are out of the way, go ahead and pull up on the plastic piece. And set it aside. 
you can see the wiring harness is clipped in right here I'm gonna use a pair of pliers to unclip this from the body of the car then disconnect the plug and then I'm ready to feed this wire through the body of the car that's all there is to it once that's out you are all done be sure to check out the other Mustang videos that I will be uploading shortly and if you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up click that subscribe button and I'll see you later